I'm going to do a quick how-to for the Great Blue Bossa tune by Kenny Dorham. We're going to be in C minor, so we're going to be playing from the sixth chord of E flat major. So there's C minor. There's E flat major. So we're thinking C Aeolian. And basically here's the head. We step a little bit outside of that scale, Aeolian scale that we played. Well, that's because we go six to the two. So that's going to sound like a one minor to the four, and then two, five to the six. Minor two, five to the six. So that's going to be seven, three, six. And then we're going to go up to. D flat major via 2 5. And that 2 5 happens to be a minor one. 5 A flat to D flat major, which is the flat 7 major. So we do a 2 5 to flat 7 major. Up a half step to the 7. 6 or 7 3 6. 2 5 to the 6. And that's the whole tune. So we basically. hit my head on this thing anyways that's the tune hope that helps it's a pretty easy song once you get it it's a good example of how to play in minor from the six and uh, you also get to see how you get to hear how the flat seven major sounds really nice so we're gonna get into more of that uh, on another video but uh, stick around and uh, Subscribe, tell your friends, and I hope this helps. Check out the link in the description. That's going to take you to the chart to where you can see all these chord shapes charted out. And uh, hopefully it makes it a little easier and uh, pair it up in the video. So be sure to download the video, um, sorry, download the uh, the book on the website. That's going to really help you. It has all the scales, all the keys, all the positions, all the chords. If you want to know how to play more voicings than just the simple ones I put on the chord sheet, then you can go and watch the uh, chord inversions, the chord shape video, and look at it, look at it. Uh, the folder <laughs> to see the lecture. So check it out, and I hope this helps.